So I want to give you some background information on the programming assignment and how technologically you can approach them. So we will write all code in Python 3 and it should be compatible with the latest Python 3 version. And we use Python for a number of reasons, but mainly because it abstracts away big num arithmetic. So if you work in another programming language, you have to write your own code for large numbers. And in cryptography, we use a lot of large numbers. Um, so Python just abstracts that away and we don't have to deal with it. Also, Python is very commonly used and can be learned pretty fast. So there's a big chance that some of you already know how to program in Python. And if you don't, you should be able to pick up on it pretty fast. And it's very readable, which is nice if you try to understand other people's code. So we want to learn cryptography through coding. And for that, Python is the ideal tool because it's very readable and it abstracts away a lot of the things that we don't care about. So what we're doing is essentially we write our cryptographic primitives in pseudocode, but the pseudocode is actually executable because it's valid Python code and then we can actually use those primitives to play around with them. So the reference platform uh, that I'll be showing you uh, in the tutorials will be uh, Visual Studio Code with the standard Python extension on Arch Linux. So you can use whatever you want for your programming. I just want to say that if you run into troubles, we won't be supporting you unless you use a Linux distribution with VS Code. So if you use anything else and if you run into problems there, we won't be there to support you. So yes, this entire course has only one point, namely for me to be able to say, by the way, I use Arch.